how to cut a curve or path or object in Affinity Designer. I've got a shape here and I've cut it straight line down. So how do I do that? So let's just remove it and now just go and create any shape. It doesn't have to be a circle, but I'm just going to go with circle. It's easier. And you've got that. Once you've done that, you can go and press the knife tool or K on the keyboard. So it's K, shortcut. Straight away, you've got your knife tool. I'm going to go with straight line. So make certain you go with this option here. And also got auto close on as well. So that one, straight line. And just go above and then hold down the shift and go past it and release. And now you've cut that. And you can do the same again. So go down there and release and do it again and do it again. Now you'll notice what's happening as I do that. Some of the curves are no longer selected. So unfortunately, it doesn't remember just to keep them all actually live and selected. It doesn't do that. Now, if you've only got five or six curves here, what you can do is you can actually just select them all. Simply just select them on here, over here in the layers. Makes it easier. And also you can also just go here to the move tool, press V, and then just drag over. And that will also select them all as well. You may or may not want to do it that way. Perfectly reasonable. But what you can also do, so you, let's just deselect it or select one of them. Once selected, you can go over here to select. And there's an option here, select all on current layer. It's not the select all. So if don't use the select all. Use the select all on current layer. And that's shift, command or control, depending on what machine you're on, and A. So it's that shortcut there. I don't, could do that, but I'm just going to go obviously for the menu. And then all of them are selected. And now, again, press K. And you've got the knife tool. And you can again hold down the shift. And you can then go that direction. And then again, do it again. And so on. Now, of course, it doesn't matter because I'm going downwards. That They're still all selected. But the ones at the top are not selected. So again, you can use the shortcut. Or go up here to select and select all on current layer. It's not in the layer menu. Quite often I always think the layer menu, but it's actually in select, select all on current layer. So now once you've got them all again, again, you can continue with your knife tool and apply it again. And again, going upwards maybe this time. And you can see, of course, they're still selected there and release. So now you've cut your curve. So let's just remove all that. So let's just quickly drag, select all those and create another one. And quickly, what I can do, knife tool again, press K. Instead of a straight line, you can also simply just go a nice curve. So let's just apply it and just drag, and I drag over, and like that very higgly piggly, and release. And I can do that again, and I can do that again, go over there, and again, just drag over there, and drag over. Now you'll notice straight away that some of the curves again are not selected. So you can do exactly the same as before. Go up here, select and select all on current layer. And they're all selected again. And then you can continue with the knife tool and apply it again like that. Hope you found this of interest and use. Any questions, please let me know in the comments below. Always appreciate it. Bye.